In the journey of personal development, one of the first things to learn is the lesson of the seas. Lesson of the seasons. Lesson of the seasons. The lesson of the seasons. Life in business is like the changing seasons. Live a more extraordinary life. One of the best ways to illustrate what's happening in your business, what's happening in your life, is this illustration of the changing seasons. Frank Sinatra used to sing, Life is like the seasons. Like the seasons. One of the things that, you know, come to grips with is what you can change and what you cannot change. You cannot change the seasons. You can change yourself. You cannot change the seasons, but you can change yourself. Therein lies the chance to live an extraordinary life. Learning to change yourself. In an economic sense, my mentor put it this way, to climb the ladder of success as high as you wish to climb, here's the key, work harder, work harder on yourself than you do on your job. Work harder on yourself work harder than you do on your job. He said if you work hard on your job, you can make a living, which is fine. But if you work hard on yourself, you could make a fortune. If you work hard on your job, you can make a living. But if you work hard on yourself, you can make a fortune. Then let's put it in philosophical language. Two things on economics, philosophically. Here's the first one I learned. Your income is primarily determined by your philosophy. Now, I didn't learn that until I was 25 years old. They never taught it in high school. I went to college one year and never heard it. Your income is primarily determined by your philosophy, not the economy. You can change yourself. Then when I finally understood that, I got excited about it. Because I knew I couldn't change the economy. But I was assured that I certainly could change my philosophy. And I did that. And here's the philosophy. Success is something you attract by becoming an attractive person. Success is not something you pursue, it's something you attract. Become an attractive person.